Good morning guys, welcome back to my channel. It is 7.09 a.m. and I have to leave the house in 20 minutes, so let me like brush my teeth and do my skincare and all that stuff. So I have 10 minutes until I need to leave, so I was like, let me just drink some green tea. You guys are probably like, why is she at school right now? It's literally summer break, I know. But I started tutoring some former students that I had and I'm also doing summer camp. So I knew I wouldn't be able to sit home and just do nothing all summer. So it's literally, it's nothing crazy. I am tutoring for like an hour in the mornings from like eight to nine. And then I go straight to summer camp after nine to 2 p.m. So it's just like the morning part of my day. I don't really do much during that time anyway. So I was like, might as well do some summer camp and tutoring. And the summer camp is only Monday, Wednesdays. And I tutor Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. So I have the rest of my week. And the summer camp is just like this week and then next week and then that's basically it. So it's nothing crazy and I was like, might as well have something to do. And I just love being in my classroom. I don't know why. It's just so fun. I feel like I can never leave. Next up is summer camp, which I will be there till 2 p.m. I'm a little nervous. Like, I don't know. I've never done summer camp, so I don't really know what to expect. I'm sure it'll be fun, but I will let you guys know how it goes. See y'all when I'm done. Guys, I just left camp. Oh my gosh, it's two o'clock. It was such a fun day. We had so much fun, but let me tell you, it was literally burning hot. We walked to the gardens, which is like a couple minutes down the road. So we took a walk there, we played there, it was super cute, but it is just not the weather for hijabis. It was literally like almost 100 degrees and it was like sticky hot, you know, like there was no wind, the sun was just burning. And now I leave to go home, it's raining. I'm like, are you kidding me? Like, what is this bipolar weather? But, um, done now and I get to go home. Actually, I'm not going home, I'm going to Sam's because we have no meat in our house. Yesterday I tried to cook steak, I opened the freezer, no steak. So I was like, okay, I'll do shrimp. I opened the freezer again, no shrimp. So we literally didn't cook. I, we didn't have dinner yesterday. So now I'm gonna stop really quickly at Sam's, pick up some groceries, and then head home. Before I go to Sam's, I kind of want a drink, a drinky drink. I just don't know what I want. Do I want McFlurry? Do I want boba, a watermelon slush? Hmm. Okay, I came to Tipioca Lounge. They did not answer the phone, so I'm just gonna go in and get a watermelon boba. So, I'll be right back. Okay, I got it. I am so excited to drink it. It's a watermelon slush. Guys, it's so, like, amazing. Especially on a hot day. Which it was so hot earlier. Now it's raining, but I'm like, no, no. Like, I still need this. I didn't get boba in it. I'm not like the... I don't care for boba. Oh my gosh, can you hear the rain? It's so loud. Mmm. It's, it's like straight up, you're literally just eating a watermelon. Mm. And watermelon is my favorite fruit. Watermelon and mangoes. So good. I have to return this dress I got from ASOS that I tried to get for Aid. I'm going to put a picture of it somewhere on this screen, okay? Let me just tell you, it looked nothing like the photo. I got it in and I put it on and it just didn't, it didn't give at all, actually. So... I'm returning it and I'm really sad because it looked so cute in the photo and now I need to find something else. So, off to the post office and Sam's and then I'm gonna be home, finally. You guys know those people that take forever to finish drinks? Let me tell you, I am not one of those people. I just got this drink, it took me about 10 minutes to get here and I'm already like halfway done with it. I'm literally such a fast eater or drinker. It's a quick trip so all I got was some meat, shrimp and plates. Did you guys think I was gonna leave Sam's and not get a hot dog? It's like three o'clock right now, so it's like an awkward time and I haven't really eaten. So I'm gonna eat half and give the other half to my husband until we eat dinner. Tell me why I spent like almost $200 and I bought one, two, three, four, five things. Which were like, I mean, I guess I got meat, but like, dang.
I ended up getting these little granola bars because the sample people got me and they're actually so good and they're like apparently natural ingredients. Like My husband is outside searing this steak and I just did some broccolini. My sister-in-law did it and it was so good when we ate it. It's just some garlic oil. I did seasoned salt because um, I thought that would be better with steak and a little bit of couscous. I prefer this, not prefer, I had it and it was really good. So I thought it'd be good instead of regular rice. Let's go see what he is doing. This is where, maybe I should turn the stove off. Ooh, <laughs> that's embarrassing. <laughs> Anyways, let's go see um, what he is grilling, what it's looking like. Oh, he's not even grilling. The steak is right in my face. It's right there. We'll be back. Okay, we wanna see the steaks. Show us what they're looking like. Yum. Okay, this is dinner today. I feel like we look so skinny today. We don't usually eat, I feel like, meat, rice, and like a veggie. I don't know, we usually eat like pastas and Arabic food and that kind of stuff. So we're being skinny queens. One of my favorite things to do is when I get meat to bag them, like whether it's steak, chicken, salmon. I love like bagging them. I don't know why, I find it so fun. So we just finished dinner. I have to have something sweet after I eat. So I got out these little ice cream things from Trader Joe's, let it focus, hold on. They are so good guys. It's literally like an ice cream with a little sandwich on the bottom. I'm obsessed. Mm. Like I need sweet stuff the second I finish eating. They're so good. I feel like that's how I describe everything. So good. They are um, superb. All right, let's do some skincare. I just took a shower. I'm gonna put my lip mask on. The freaking best, guys. I can't stop talking about it because like how shocked I was at how amazing it smells. It just smells like straight up cotton candy. I was using Laneige for, I think forever, honestly. And I switched to this because it smells so good. I'm obsessed with chapstick. Like I literally have to have it on 24, 24 seven. My lips are always dry and I have such a bad habit of picking them. And I'm out of cotton balls. So we're gonna just have to use some toilet paper for my toner. This toner is Obagi. Um, looks like this. So the story behind this is I was in the gym working out and I saw two girls that had such nice skin, okay? I went up to them, I was like, what? Like their skin was so nice that I had to go up to them. And I'm not like that at the gym. Like I don't go up to people. So I went up to them and I was like, you guys have like the best skin I've ever seen. What do you use? And they were like, we actually work at a medical spa. And I was like, well, that makes so much sense. Their skin is perfect. And I was like, oh my God, like literally book me an appointment right now. I need to come to your spa and I just want to have your face. So she booked me an appointment and I went to her spa and I got some skincare. Um, mainly, no, I didn't get skincare. I just got that toner. And I felt like it made a big difference in my skin. Um, and yeah, and I just love it. Do I look like her though? No, I don't have her face, but it works. I never even used toner before. And now that I do use toner, I'm like, oh my God, like I see such a difference in my skin. Um, next is just some Cetaphil moisturizer. And that's about it for my night routine. I maybe will put on some eye cream, but like I said last time, like I just feel like it doesn't do anything. I honestly just put it on for giggles. That's all my night routine is. And then when I have a pimple, Put some Retin-A, Retinol, Tretinoin, don't know what it's called. Mine, it looks like this. Is it focused? I think it is. It looks like this, got it at my dermatologist um, a couple days ago. I had like the biggest zit in the world right here. Biggest zit, it hurt, I've never, I never get zits. And then you just put some of this on and it goes away. I swear, I will put this and like within two days, whatever's on my face is gone. Not even two, like the next day. So I love this. I actually used to be on Accutane. I think I got on Accutane when I was like 17 maybe. Um, I had pretty bad skin. I would show pictures, but I have to like dig to find some, but I had like bad skin. I was out here looking like a pepperoni pizza, guys. Anyways, I got on Accutane. I had a personally a great experience with it. I hear like these crazy, crazy side effects. I didn't have any, alhamdulillah, thank God, none, but. I mean, it was a miracle for my acne. If you struggle with acne, definitely go to a dermatologist and check on getting Accutane because it was amazing. 
Oh, okay, next I put on this lash serum, obsessed with it, Rodin Fields Lash Serum. Guys, if I don't use lash serum, I look like a fish. Like, no joke, straight up a fish. So, lash serum is a necessity in my um, routine. You only use it at night. And then my useless eye cream that does nothing but just to make me feel like I'm doing something. And yeah. I feel like not many... Ugh. Like, I feel like there's an argument between people that shower in the morning and people that shower at night. I hear that debate all the time and I just don't get it. I'm a night shower. Like, you're out all day long. You're sweating. Even if you don't think you're sweating, like your body naturally just releases odors and stuff. And then people will be out all day and come home and just get in bed. Like, that blows my mind. I don't get the concept. Like, don't tell me you don't sweat. You do. You do without even noticing it. And besides that, like you're out all day, like you're sitting in public chairs, you're touching things, your clothes are like uh, caressing stuff. I don't know, that's really gross to me. Because let's say you, you, let's say you did shower at night, you're just asleep and then you wake up, you're asleep in your home, your air, like it's not dirty, you're not in the outside world. Um, now I'll take morning showers sometimes, but on top of a night shower, like every night I have to take a night shower. Morning shower, I'll do it, you know, just for like some spice and some giggles, but no night showers, no, not night showers, morning showers, I don't get that. Like if you only shower every morning, what about all the dirt and debris you collected all day long? Doesn't make sense to me. But anyways, ugh, ignore the fact the bed's not made, guys. That's my husband's fault because I was out of the house before him this morning because I went to camp. Anyways, this is literally my favorite time of the day to just sit and relax and unwind. Ugh, I live for this. Anyways, so yeah, that's really it for the night. I'm not planning to do anything else. I'm just going to hang out in bed and relax. I hope you guys notice a difference in this quality of my video. I really hope so because I spent a check on this camera that I'm using right now. And when I record, I notice such a big difference. Like it's amazing quality, but I'm just like, I hope it uploads an amazing quality. Cause I would look back and watch my last video the spend the day with me or whatever. It came out in pixels. I'm like, how? Cause I did it on my phone guys and it was great quality. Like when I watched back, I was like, this is good quality. And I go to upload it and it sucked. So after that, I was like, mm-mm, mm-mm. So I literally went and ran to Best Buy and bought this camera, dropped a check, came home, and here we are now using the camera just for you guys. So go ahead and like this video and leave a comment if you appreciate that because I'm doing it for y'all. Anyways, um, yeah, so I hope it's great quality when I post it. And that's about it for the night. I'm just going to hang out and scroll through TikTok probably because that's all I ever do. I hope you guys liked this video. I hope you enjoyed spending the day with me. If there's anything else you guys want to see, like my makeup routine or my night routine or blah, 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 literally anything, leave it in the comments, guys, and I will do whatever you guys ask for. So I hope you enjoyed this video. See you guys next time.